guys, what's up? I hope you're having a great week. Today I'm gonna to share with you how I keep my teeth naturally white and my mouth healthy. I started looking into all of this a few years ago when I started changing out all of my beauty products and personal care products for more natural ones because I started reading about the ingredients that were in them and I just didn't want to keep putting them on my body. And one of the first places that I found that I could change was my toothpaste. And even though I wanted to make sure to keep out unhealthy chemicals and unnatural ingredients, it was still really important to me to keep my mouth really clean and my teeth really white because I've had braces for three years it took a really long time and it was a lot of work and money. And I've also had gum surgery and I'm on camera a lot. So I tried a lot of different things and I've sort of devised what works for me. There are a lot of really, really bad and weird tasting natural mouth care products out there. So I think I can save you a lot of the headache of trying all of those and show you what works for me. So the first thing that I use is tooth powder. So I use the EcoDent Extra Bright Powder. And Eco didn't sponsor this video, so they sent me a couple of other different ones to show you guys and to try, but this is my favorite, the Extra Bright, because it has extra whitening. I also have the Daily Care, which tastes pretty similar to the Extra Bright. It just doesn't have extra, extra whitening in it. And then the Kids one, which I don't have kids myself, but I did have my boyfriend's daughter try it, and she gave me her review, which was good and I tried it myself too. So those are two other options. There are a few reasons that I prefer tooth powder to toothpaste. The first is that it's very hard to find a toothpaste that doesn't contain fluoride. And fluoride is sort of a controversial ingredient. There have been several studies that have suggested that over a long period of time of using fluoride, a buildup of it in your body can be detrimental. Since most city water already has fluoride added into it, I don't add any extra fluoride into my body through toothpaste. So all the EcoDent tooth powders don't have any fluoride added, so I love that. I like that it's a powder also because since it stays dry, when the powder mixes with the water in your mouth, it makes an effervescent action. So it's cleaning your mouth and foaming up and bubbling. So it's not using all that effervescent power on being mixed with water in the tube. It only happens when it mixes in your mouth. It's also easier to travel with because you don't have to put it in your liquid bag, so you can just throw it in your suitcase and you don't have to worry about it at the airport. I like to brush my teeth a lot, so I also like that it's less abrasive than toothpaste because it doesn't scrape your teeth and wear down your enamel. What I like to do is I wake up and I brush my teeth because I just like to get everything out of my mouth that's been there while I was sleeping. So before I eat breakfast even, I brush my teeth. So usually with a regular toothpaste, that would just make everything taste horrible. I don't know if you've ever like brushed your teeth and then taking a sip of orange juice, it just makes you regret brushing your teeth so badly. So I like this because I can brush my teeth and I can still eat breakfast and I'll have that minty fresh feeling, but it doesn't have that like sour clash of flavors. It kind of just wears off gently and your breakfast is safe. And then I go back and brush my teeth again after breakfast. One tip with the tooth powder, because I do like to brush my teeth in the shower, I don't keep the container in the shower because since it is powder, it can absorb a lot of that humidity from your shower and then that can make the effervescence not work and it also just won't shake out of the container as easily. So I just keep it in my cabinet, put it on my toothbrush and then I bring it in the shower with me. The next thing that I do on a daily basis is floss. And I've had a dentist tell me that if it came down to choosing brushing or flossing, they'd rather that you floss because I guess they think it just gets that much more stuff from between your teeth than a brush does. So I always do that every single day and I notice a big difference even if I forget and then I start back, I notice a big difference after only one time. So you might think, well, floss is just floss. Like what's the big deal with the difference in products that you use? There are a few different things that the EcoDent Floss does that I really like. Well, first off, all of EcoDent's products are cruelty free and I love that. And especially with floss, um, vegans take note. So this is a vegan floss and a lot of flosses are waxed. So they, a lot of times they use beeswax to wax the floss. So it's no beeswax, it's all plant-based waxes and also no mineral wax. So if you avoid mineral oil or other petroleum-based products, then you're also safe with this. 
This is their cranberry and aloe vera flavor. So it also uses natural essential oils from both of those ingredients. It's not just flavoring, but those essential oils are also going to be helping your mouth when you're flossing. Oh, one other thing, I saved this because the packaging, it actually comes like this. So it's also better for the environment because it comes like this. So it hangs on its little hanger. And then you just rip this part off and voila, there's your case. So instead of being plastic, it's just a paper container. It is water resistant though, so it doesn't really like get really gross in your bathroom, but that way you can just recycle the paper when you're done. The last thing I do in my daily routine is use my mouth rinse. And this is the EcoDent Tartar Guard mouthwash. And I love it for a few reasons. First is no alcohol. I was one of those kids that when my parents told me to use mouthwash, I would like run away and hide because I hated it. Surprisingly, alcohol in mouthwashes has been potentially linked to mouth cancer. So I hate having alcohol in my mouthwash. And if that's a possibility, then I definitely don't want it. But the other thing that makes this my standout mouthwash is the blend of essential oils and other ingredients that it has that all work together to really keep your mouth fresh. It has peppermint oil, tea tree oil, echinacea extract, CoQ10, golden seal extract, orange oil, lemon oil, anise oil, basil, rosemary, geranium, rose water concentrate, witch hazel concentrate, aloe. So all these things just work together to really help the health of your mouth throughout the day. That's what I do every single day. And then on a weekly basis, I also add in oil pulling for about 15 to 20 minutes with an organic coconut oil. And I'll make another video for you guys to go more into depth about that. Another trick you can do if you feel like your teeth are dingy and there's nothing you can do about it right in this moment is you can add a red lipstick. So today I'm wearing it's a pretty um, pretty neutral red, but maybe leaning a little bit towards orange. The best red that you wanna use is a blue-based red because the blue will help cancel out the yellow showing up in your teeth, so your teeth will look whiter. I'm Southern and I drink a ton of sweet tea. I drink a ton of green tea. Every single day, I'm just pretty much drinking tea. I don't like to feel like those stains are just sitting on my teeth and getting deeper and deeper in. So. As soon as I am done drinking my drink that could stain my teeth, I rinse it out with water. Especially if you guys are really big soda drinkers, definitely do that because it's even worse than tea because it has so much acid in soda that it can really damage your teeth. So that's it for my routine. I hope you guys like it. It's just a few simple changes that can make a big difference in your health and the whiteness of your teeth over time. EcoDent also gave me a code for you guys for 10% off their whole website. So if you wanna try anything out, definitely use that. I'll put it right here for you guys. Oops. So let me know if you guys have any questions about this down in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see you next time.